What's up guys, it is BK. I am going to try something different first of all. I am now recording in 4K instead of the 2.7K that I normally record in because I've been noticing once I edit and render my videos in Premiere, I don't know if it's the compression options that I have set in Premiere or if it's just my resolution isn't high enough to overcome the graininess and the loss of quality that I get within the compression when I edit but I'm going to try to bump it up on up to 4k and sacrifice my 60 frames per second and see how that goes and see if 4k fixes that problem a little bit I'm probably going to go ahead and check my settings and Premiere and everything too just so I can provide you guys with the highest quality possible in my videos and hopefully it won't be too skippy because I went downgraded from 60 frames to 30 and if it is then I'll just go back to what I used to do and hopefully there's a setting somewhere in Premiere that I can reduce the compression a little bit and that'll help a little bit with uh, the quality downgrade. But anyways, I am heading back from college right now. Tabby's still in class. She has until 4.20 today and it's only 11. So I have some stuff to do at home. I have to go get my hair cut and then I gotta transfer some video footage that I got from a family member's wedding. I have to transfer that over to uh, a disc, either a disc or a flash drive, and then uh, take the pictures that I took and that video and see if I can meet up with that family member and give them their pictures and stuff. And then I kind of want to straighten up my room a little bit too before I have to head back to Dalton to go to floods. And hopefully floods won't be too bad tonight, but we're definitely going to try to detail the quarry because, I mean, we detailed it last time, but it looks like it's going to be a detail every time kind of place. So we're going to make sure we do a really good job there. And that'll be around five or so, so. I have a few hours to waste to uh, get some stuff done at home and I might even be able to study for a little while and hopefully I can get all that done before I have floods tonight. So I'm at the haircut place now. I'm going to get my haircut real quick and then I'll probably be heading home. So. Hopefully it turns out pretty good. So, I uh, just got to have my hair cut. It doesn't look that much different than before because I pretty much just got it thinned out a little bit so it's not as thick and hard to deal with. But, I mean, he took a little bit off of the back and stuff so I kind of got rid of that curl in the back. That way it doesn't start curling up and doing weird stuff. And then he took it off my ears too. So, uh that way it won't hang in my ears and irritate me and stuff but i'm gonna leave from here and probably head home and load those videos on a disc or a flash drive i haven't decided yet and then see if i can get in touch with that family member and see if i can uh get to her today or tomorrow or at some point and then um I'll probably just relax for a little while and then head back up to the college about an hour or two before work starts. That way I can study a little bit at the college and get that done before I have to head to work tonight. So I have started thinking about getting a different car because I mean this is a good car and everything but uh, within the next year or two I uh, have a car in mind I want something more sporty and more of a sports car and I also want something in a manual transmission and I think the car that I've decided on is the uh, 2018 Subaru WRX STI 
and I think it's pretty much a perfect fit for me it's not going to be too hard to maintain and I mean it does have to have premium fuel so I'll have to make sure I have the money and stuff for that and then also the amount of money to move out and everything but I also applied for a job at Verizon so hopefully uh, they'll somewhat consider me and that job is listing on indeed.com to pay at least 40 uh, grand a year which is not bad at all especially for what I'm trying to do so if I get that job then some big things are coming in the future and hopefully I'll be able to uh, get that car uh, move out with Tabby because she's really wanting to do that and then um, if I need to pay for my college if I don't get Hope back then I'll have the money to pay for my college myself and everything and I won't have to take out student loans or anything so hopefully it all works out because I really need some more money this time since I lost my vending job but however ever since I lost the vending job I felt a lot more happy and not drugged down by work because floods they're just so much better even if it's a harder job just having a good boss and good crew members and stuff to work with it just makes it a much more enjoyable experience and if I can somehow uh, get a job like that if the Verizon job is like that or I get another job that's like that then that'd be perfect because I don't want to have to dread going to work every single day when I have work even if I'm making a good bit of money so hopefully I'll either keep floods or I'll get another job and hopefully it'll have a good staff and everything and I can actually enjoy going to work and it'll be just an overall enjoyable experience leading up to get all this money to get all this stuff that we need so another thing that I got recently that's different is I got a garage door opener for both my garage and my uh, grandfather's garage so I can now park in the garage when my parents aren't home and they'll keep my car from getting as hot which will be real nice too okay guys so if you haven't checked it out yet you definitely need to I posted a couple days ago of the total solar eclipse and it only has one view right now I think that was like my dad or something but um, I'd say I got some really good footage considering the conditions that I was in and I have a bunch of really good pictures in there that not a lot of people have because I use my dad's big camera so not just normal phone pictures and stuff and it turned out really well and I did some exposure adjustments and stuff on it and it just turned out really well so make sure to check out some of my uh other videos I've been posting recently because my vlogs have been getting a lot better and there's some stuff in there y'all don't want to miss out on so make sure to go check those out when you get a chance so I don't know if I told you guys that I got a new kitten it's one of Danny's kittens from Tabby's house and she's really playful but uh, She's staying here with me now, and she's really cute. So I'm on my way back to the college. I had about a, I don't know, hour and a half, two hour break. And I am heading back to the college now in order to uh, study a little bit before Tabby and I have to go to floods tonight. And Hopefully I can get a decent amount of studying in even though I took that break, but I got my hair cut So that was the main thing I needed to get done today And I completely found out that my GoPro completely quit recording for some reason during the wedding So unfortunately I don't have that footage, but it was more of a if you can kind 
kind of deal so uh, I don't think they'll be too upset that I wasn't able to record it but um, I did get the pictures and everything so at least the pictures look pretty good and I don't know why my GoPro just randomly stopped recording but either way um, I'm on my way back to the college now and I'll probably read some chapters in my books since I haven't had them in the first few days of college so we're on our way there and hopefully it won't be too long before we head to floods and then hopefully I don't get home too 